One thing the governor is encouraged about is the vaccines that are set to arrive in Alabama in just the matter of days. WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough has the latest on plans to get those vaccines to those who need it the most. With the FDA set to approve emergency use authorization for the Pfizer vaccine on Thursday, Alabama State Health Officer Dr. Scott Harris says the first doses could arrive in Alabama sometime early next week. We just have to remember we've, we've got almost 4,000 of our family and loved ones and friends who aren't going to be here this holiday season that we've lost so far in our state. If, if you had a if you had a 747 crash every month for the last 10 months, uh, that's about how many people we've lost in the past 10 months in our state. The expected rollout of the Pfizer vaccine gives Dr. Harris and other health leaders some hope when things are otherwise discouraging right now. Harris says the state will receive about 41,000 doses starting out. We get lots of questions and lots of social media rumors that there's vaccine here already, but there is not. And Dr. Harris says the big challenge with the Pfizer vaccine is storage, keeping it at negative 80 degrees Celsius, only a few hospitals can do that right now. Once uh, the hospitals get those vaccines and we have the recommendation from the advisory council, the ACIP, uh, we'll be ready to get shots into arms uh, hopefully that day, that day or the next day. Hospitals will keep some doses for their own staff, but then work with the Alabama Department of Public Health to distribute the rest to other high priority groups, such as those in nursing homes. Two weeks from now, Harris expects more doses of the Pfizer vaccine as well as the Moderna vaccine. In Birmingham, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13.